Welcome back folks. This is Denise from Seuss Art and we are going to put another layer on it. This is part three of the leaf project and I want to show you how it dried which was really cool. And I learned something. I learned something from everything I do. <laughs> but I love this right here. I don't know if you can see it. But it it's where the leaf kind of shows in underneath the epoxy because the light is behind it. So, ha, note to self, when I do the leaves, put the lights. All right. <laughs> so other than that, everything looks great. Um, the mushroom doesn't fit, so I've got a whole new plan. And um, I took uh, some of my lights and I cut them short. And I'm going to apply them in this area. And then I'm going to apply uh, uh, this bucket of gravel. <laughs> Oh, goodness. It's tough. Okay, see? This black gravel. And that's going to be the area where I'm going to put a house. And so the house will be above the black gravel with just little bits of light showing through. And hopefully if I do this proper, I should be able to get the lights in the windows. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. Um... So let's get gluing. Uh, right now it's just a matter of getting this wire down. And getting it to stay. And uh, I'm using my silicone finger thingy because I had enough pain. <laughs> I tend to burn myself. All right. Stop. So always, always uh, be be weary of burns. You don't want to do that. Um, again, when you're using epoxy, uh, wear a ventilator. Just because I don't doesn't mean you shouldn't. That's working out really well. All right. So this is a really fun project. Um, you know what? I'm not sure, but I'm pretty, oh, well, though I'm pretty sure um, I'm going to run out of epoxy before Friday, which is okay because I'll order some Thursday and get, get it Saturday. So I'm um, the final bit. I think I've got enough for two more layers. So the final bit will be on um, next Saturday. Because <laughs> that's usually, if I order Thursday, spend the extra money for an overnighty, I'll get it on them. Um, Saturday. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying not to burn myself here. Where else am I applying the glue? Oh, let's check the house. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to cut that right there. Mm. Put that right about there. Um, so, after we get this done, we're going to spray some more alcohol on here. And, uh, that's my husband's needs. <laughs> then I'm going to apply the rocks. And then we'll, we'll do a layer of epoxy. Real simple today. So I go back tomorrow back to work tomorrow my two days are off <laughs> and um, hopefully we'll get some of this done tomorrow night because the rest of the week I'll be pretty tired till come Thursday <laughs> Whew. 
Yeah, you can't move around as fast as I do and not, not feel the ramifications of your actions. <laughs> yeah, that's it. All right. That looks pretty good. All right, guys, let's um, let's turn this on so that we can add our rocks appropriately. Worry about all that stuff later. Uh, so house, where's house? What they do with house? <laughs> oh, come on, house. Where'd you go? Oh, for crying out loud. I don't know. Oh, here it is. That's <laughs> so hard to see. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, so let's let's load this up with rocks. over your stuff. Oh, it wants another stick of glue. Ooh. I have colored glue too. I haven't used it yet. Get down. Nobody asked you to remove. <laughs> down here. Let's do that first and see where we're at. Get down. Ooh, this rubber thingy is great. <laughs> Gravel. But it don't fit. You can't commit. All right, while that's drying real quick, I'm gonna get, um, check the house again. Oh yeah, somebody's, somebody lives there. That's for shizzle. We can turn that light out. Dim it. Ooh. Nice. See what else can we do? We can do this one. Mm. I don't mind a little bit. And I like that one right there. So that looks good. That looks really good. I'm happy. Okay, so um, we're just going to let this dry for a few minutes, and I will see you right back here. Welcome back. All right, guys, so now we've, we've got the rocks where we want them, kind of hiding the cords, and we're going to apply some moss. Um, and for this piece, I, I picked out this beautiful one here. I'm going to put this right here in the corner, like so. Um, I have some red and some purple. <laughs> I'd like to do the purple where the house is going to be. Kind of gives the, the house a little, um, je ne sais quoi. <laughs> I don't know what that, what that means. <laughs> All right, so let's use our lights and um, kind of get an idea of how I'm going to apply this. I like that. Um, right like that okay so i'm just gonna hit this up with some glue glooby mm, glooby glooby glue mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right. and put that right 
there. Perfecto. Very nice. Because um, as you can see on the next layer, that house is going right there. And uh, that's going to be really, really nice. Nice little contrasty. Oh. Pop some down here. <laughs> now this moss might take a good, uh, I don't know, maybe two layers before it's finally buried, but it'll be It'll look like it's on a bunch of layers. How cool is that? Ouch. <laughs> oh, goodness. All right. You still attached? All right. <laughs> Let's get this guy in there. Ooh, got a big stick. I love working with this organic material. I mean, it adds such a, a, a beautiful, um, uh, I don't know. Texture. <laughs> All sorts of good stuff. Alright. You go there. And that leaves this spot, y'all. For you. Yeah. I don't know, I like this so much I might not even put a house in here. <laughs> There's a good chance I won't. Um, because I don't think it needs a house now, it just needs that other tree. Well, but I'm torn between this shape here or this one which isn't painted yet. Which I haven't painted yet. Oh, I think, I think I might go with that one. Let's see, we got this which really matches this guy a lot because we're that. Oh, this one. <laughs> yeah, so I'll have to paint that. And we'll save the house. I'm thinking let's do a little more of that um, moss. Nothing wrong with moss that has lights behind it. Nothing wrong with that. Boy, they're really cheap on the purple, aren't they? Come on, guys. <laughs> Whatever. Take what you got. This other sheet's huge. It'd make a nice front yard somewhere. <laughs> Turf. Oh, that bag fell apart, too. Oh, it's so pretty. So we have rocks that we'll be able to see. We have a beautiful moss that we'll be able to see. There. Wow, that's pretty. <laughs> All right, guys. Next time um, we're back, we're going to pour our epoxy. And uh, we'll know we, we're going to spray. So let's do that first. Um. All right. Let's clean it. Because we mean it. up some blue. Touch those sides. Get some brown on the ground. Yep. 
yellow on the ground. Mitchell's done. Green on the ground. And of course, white. Wah! It's going to look a little different when you come back and it's all done. <laughs> Gorgeous. All right, guys. I will see you... Um, in just a few, we're going to pour the resin and call this one a third be done. Welcome back, everybody. Again, Denise from Cease Art, and we're going to get ready to pour some epoxy resin. Yay! Um, and by the way, today's beats are brought to you by my husband, who is in the room right over there. And he has built himself three tube amps. One is the half the size of the room. It could get loud. I don't know. But, so... <laughs> He's just in there jamming. <laughs> he likes to do that. Okay, so um, everything's been poured and stirred, and uh, let's just get it on. I think I have one more cup of epoxy left out of this batch, so I should be able to um, do another layer over this tomorrow. Now, to this layer, I'm not adding anything. Um, no colors, no uh, fillers, no nothing. Just a nice clear coat. Well, let's get all the lights on. Come on. There we go. <laughs> I know it looks intense to you guys, but it's really not that intense to me at all. It's nice and subtle and This was easy. Now we're just going to take out the uh, bubbles with my beauty. Yesterday I really didn't have any bubbles because I was doing so much before we came back to pour that um, all the bubbles in the cup left. So. <laughs> Be mindful of your moss. Oh, that looks really pretty. Um, so, I'll bring you down, 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 down. And we'll take a little, little look at what's going on. Um, there is a tree in the background. Um, I know the sun shouldn't be up at night, but I love it. She's there. Um, we have some night sky. We have moss of varying colors and degrees. And this is a second layer of epoxy. So, um, we'll turn the lights off and let you see it from another perspective. It's kind of pretty either way. Um, actually, that sun and the tree look like they've become one back there. <laughs> it's really nice. And uh, so tomorrow what we're going to do is um, probably I, my last layer of epoxy. I might be able to, I have two other bottles that might be able to work, but it's a different brand. And um, one of them, you have to stir that sucker for 14 minutes, seven minutes in one cup and then seven minutes in another cup. It's really, it was the first epoxy I ever bought and I never bought it again. <laughs> um, I love how the camera shadow kind of makes it look like there's a man standing there maybe we'll do that right because that really looks cool like a figure off in the distance oh you know it's little things like this but i won't have the cord now we won't do the cord but definitely that right there well yeah yeah i'll make a rubber one and paint it and uh, stick that in there tomorrow because that looks awesome and then of course there's going to be another tree on a layer right in here 
and uh, my gosh, that's going to be brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> what fun! All right, guys, this is Denise from Sue's Art. Get ready to go back to work tomorrow and have a lot of fun because I love aerobics while I'm working. So, you know, it's a paid gym. I get paid to go to my gym and be creative and be a, a sous chef, and I love it. So, ciao, Bella. Thank you to all my new subscribers. I got a new one, and I don't, I can't find it in my thingy. But thank you because you have brought me to 190. Woo! <laughs> oh, I love you guys. All right. Ciao, Bella.